And this is going to be so embarrassing if you don't get this out in time for Halloween. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> yeah. It's that time of year again, folks. <laughs> Not only am I an orphan, but I'm also Ice Spice. Tissue, I need tissue. <laughs> no, I can't say this because people are going to hate me. Bring in the sick bags. <laughs> Would you eat him? Yeah. Like King Julian in Madagascar, like, yeah, he, he was like in good shape. But they had him on steroids the entire time. He You've taken me, me to church. church. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine us walking into a church like this. Hello and welcome to a very spooky episode of the And I Want to Talk About It podcast. Why is it spooky? It's because I'm finally being myself on camera. I'm not thank afraid you. anymore. No, thank you. Not only am I an orphan, but I'm also Ice Spice. I The tits and the <laughs> arse is so off-putting. You can see the arse from here. What, what are you using for the arse? That's just my ass. I'm just thick. No, Ed is coming. No, I am. I'm just thick. It's usually what I do is I like get a binder. Well, I actually get two binders and I put them together and then I just do it around my hips and waist. Um, oh. But today I thought it's Halloween. You know, let's let's just be real with each other. Halloween's the one time a year to be real. Yeah, Halloween, <laughs> Halloween is the one time to be who you really are. So do you want to explain your costume? So my I this year am... Uh, little Orphan Ice Spice. I've <laughs> never seen you in a pair of tights. <laughs> <laughs> I've never worn a pair of tights. I did it, I, I tried it without the tights two days ago. By the way, I put this together in two days. Did I can't I believe it. Is I it? I made this. It's incredible. This is, I, I was saying when I was getting ready, I was like, this actually might be the best thing that I've ever done. It's... It's weirdly good, isn't it? <laughs> my, my, eyes are <laughs> my eyes are up my there. eyes are up here. hey it's, my tits are down there <laughs> my, my tits are down there no it's a it's amazing the work and it's <laughs> so, so off-putting so off-putting um but yeah we have good this little halloween special for y'all yeah, you not? know we just thought why not we're gonna we're gonna do some, some spooky, spooky spookiness some so First of all, I wanted to talk about who is the killer. Not out of us two, but like in life, who is the killer? Like I think bus drivers, school bus drivers are the killer. I think uh, history teachers are the killer. I think... Can you give me more on what you mean by the killer? So you know how, for example, Thursday has the same vibe as a horse which has the same vibe as the number seven, which yeah. has the same vibe as the color brown, which has the same vibe as the subject of history. Yeah. Like whose vibe? Fuck, you've just absolutely, one after the other then, you just went bang, 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 bang. Th honestly. like I play that game all the time. There was one I was going to be like, oh really? But I, I that didn't happen. Mm -hmm. That didn't happen. And that resonates with me so much. It's like, do you get it? Yeah. Do you get it? So like, who is the killer? So would you say three is yellow? Yeah, I would say three is either yellow or baby like pink. A, oh, I was gonna say baby blue. Oh. Uh, but like the the oh, I've lost a nail. Can't wait to clear this all up. <laughs> Your fucking nails everywhere. That is. Are those clumps of Pritt stick? Uh, <laughs> no, they're um. I don't know what these are. They're like what, sticky pads. Oh, okay. Well, I can't wait to pick them out of the carpet as yeah, well. Yeah. Um. I wish I knew more Annie songs. You're sat with the yeah. fucking professional. You're sat with the professional. I know There's... enough Ice Spice songs. See, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Honking your breasts round. I get it. I get it. Exactly right. No, I get it. Fully. Touchable. I always. Oh. <laughs> if I, I it's, it's, it's actually a time. really good thing that I was born a male because. I think I'd be a menace. Mm. I think I'd be real. I think I'd be really fucking dangerous. But That's the real Halloween. <laughs> I'm the killer. Are you the killer? Yeah. <laughs> this is the killer. Yeah, I'm not fucking surprised. I'm not surprised. If I was to be arrested, maybe not for a murder, or maybe it is a murder, what do you think I would be arrested for? It would definitely be something in public. Yeah, yeah. It would be some kind of scene in public. Not like a ragefulness, because you don't have 
outbursts of rage. No. Oh, I don't. I don't know. I don't know. What do you think? Like, what, what do you think about me? What do I think about you? I you... think you're a bitch. <laughs> I think you're lazy. <laughs> I think. <laughs> I um, think you are a fat. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> old maiden <laughs> they were type old of shoe. Type. They were not something I would have particularly worn for myself. She said they were supposed to be worn by a beautiful woman. And if that is the case, she should have put them back on the rack because she was not qualified. (laughs) She does not possess the vernacular she thinks she does. Someone told her that she was fly, hot, sexy, and cute. And she's nothing like that. She's nothing of the sort. Whoa. I do know it all, but I've I've faltered. I think Gemma is a fat (laughs) c***. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, dude. Um, now, I know for sure mine would be some kind of, like, um, politically charged yes. um, display. It would either be, like... Oh, wait, no. I've, I've, I think I might have actually spoken about this on a previous episode. I know what mine would be. I would eat <laughs> and alive on Instagram Live. I would take eat the rich very literally. Yeah. And I'd eat them, which is saying a lot because I'm vegetarian, because I'm a good person. Would you eat him? Yeah. Like alive. Like I would keep him alive as long as possible while I ate him. What about Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. Like what's the, what's the film with the mice and there's a big like fat French mouse who's always screaming sabotage and he's like trying to set stuff on fire all the time. I think that'd be me. Guy Fawkes. Oh my God. You're very, yeah, very Guy vibes. Fawkes. Vibe, very vibe, Guy vibe, Fawkes. Vibes. Yeah, for sure. Mm, guy Fawkes. Guy Spoons, Guy Knives. <laughs> um, all all types of cutlery, but for dudes. Like, I'm so tired of using these like lady utensils and like, like lady spoon, like little spoons. Like I. What I are you wanna... saying? Stop it. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know. <laughs> what bit were you just <laughs> rambling know. on? That... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. What would be your last meal? Last meal. Last meal. Another nail down. Um, I, I said the other day, and everyone was like, "What?" But I was like, "I am who I am." I would. So the bakery has always been my weakness. I love oh, the yeah. bakery. Favorite smell. Wish I could have Favorite a perf- smell. perfume love that. bakery. Oh, ba- fresh bake. Fresh or, bake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, what are you having from the bakery though? So sweet or savory? If I was gonna, if it was like last meal, it depends what mood I'm in. But this is just some. No, I can't say this because people are gonna hate me. No, what is it? Like you this know when you have like a really like thick white soft bread. Yeah. But I would have like a tuna and sweet corn, like mayo-y, like sandwich butter on it, like a big. Fucking soft love that. Sa- Wait, why would anyone hate you for that? I tuna sweet corn is like my bag. Oh, it's your bag. That's my bag. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'd probably have like from the bakery, like a fucking jam donut. I'd probably have a few. If it was the last time, I'd probably like that. What's the reason to hold back? Yeah, no, I would go heavy. I'd go heavy on it. New York, stand the fuck up. Is that nice a, spice? Is, okay. <laughs> You're like body language and everything's just changed so <laughs> I'm just, much. I'm just, I'm just really proud of what I've done and I'm just trying to get it out there. Uh, it's out there, honey. It's out there. We're there. <laughs> oh, we're there. Um, Can I be like really honest and vulnerable with you for a second? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, I wish this wasn't true. I literally wish this wasn't true. Um, so I I was feeling really emotional the other night. Um, and I I put oh my god, <laughs> this is so embarrassing. The ordinary um, boys. No no no. I was feeling really emotional the other night, so I put on Gary Come Home from SpongeBob, and I cried so hard that I actually dropped. <laughs> I don't know what happened. I was just feeling re- just like deep emotion, like emotion. I, ha- I for no- there was no direction to put it in. Nothing happened, but for some reason, I was just like really in my feelings. Um, and I was like scrolling through TikTok, and I saw a clip from SpongeBob, and it made and it was what clip was it? It was this grill is not a home, fucking banger. And then I started thinking of like what are other good SpongeBob songs? And I went on like YouTube, and I went through like a uh, a hole of watching different songs from spongebob 
and then I was listening to Gary come home and I started crying so hard <laughs> that I was just like in my bed sobbing to the point where I was like oh I need to go to the bathroom I'm gonna throw up and I did like a little bit <laughs> what the fuck dude <laughs> yeah i don't know i don't know you good <laughs> <laughs> no i am but no that's the crazy thing i am i, I don't know where that emotion how from. does gary come home uh go you don't want me to sing that do you no right no 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 it's no. one's like gary come home <laughs> <laughs> hold on wait Gary, come home. Tissue, I need tissue. <laughs> oh, shoot. I said I was going to cry. <laughs> Fuck. But the thing is, before, fine. I hate, After, I hate the nails. fine. It's all right. They'll be gone. They'll be gone pretty quick. <laughs> um, but yeah, before, fine. After, fine. Drawing, inconsolable. Whoa. You could not. You could not talk to me. Was anyone else home? No. <laughs> Thank God. Imagine, Gary. <laughs> <laughs> but I feel better for saying that. I feel better for Good. saying that. I'm glad. Well, it's Halloween. It's uh, the one time you can be your real self. You, you <laughs> <laughs> Halloween, the one time you can be your real, <laughs> authentic self. That's what we're here for today. Okay, everyone. Wow. Something that we've, that's been keeping us going for a while. And I really like. Oh, I already know what you're going to talk about. And it is the best fucking thing in the world. <laughs> it's the best fucking thing in the world. Yeah. Yeah. The AI songs. <laughs> <laughs> this has kept me and Ellis going literally four months and it's not ending. It's not ending. The, but It's banger after banger after banger. This takes up so many of my notes on my phone. <laughs> That I just, like, whether or not we were just going to do a spooky episode today, I have to talk about it today. So, obviously, the AI covers of songs started coming out a few months back. And there was one in particular that really... Really struck. Struck. Um, Something really deep. It resonated really deeply for both of us. I've got one thing to say, and that is King Julian sings his Fuck it, it's motherfucking arsehole. I don't know who hurt that lemur, <laughs> but he's feeling it. He sings his arse off. <laughs> like that, like that. <laughs> that's the difference. <laughs> What's the one where he goes? Oh, it's I'm feeling <laughs> I'm alive. feeling alive. <laughs> Fuck. My heels on. I'm feeling alive. Honestly, and um. My love has got <laughs> humor. <laughs> Fuck. Take take Julian to church. He You've taken me, me to church. church. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine us walking into a church like this. Set <laughs> on fire. No, I can actually <laughs> see that actually makes sense though. <laughs> I can actually see you in church. More so <laughs> like this <laughs> any, than any. Anywhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. It's actually like It's giving it's giving church. Yeah, it's giving. Yeah. It is giving church. It it's is so funny. King Julian AI songs. Careless Whisper as well. <gasps> Him do like, Careless Whisper is fucking gorgeous. Like there, there are some Tonight King- the music <laughs> seems so loud. <laughs> like this man, this mat, this gorgeous <laughs> man, gorgeous hunk of a he's, man. He's obviously he's got like a story to tell. Like obviously, like he's just released all these covers. Like no one was expecting that from king julian for year, years after the film like if it were if he yeah. was in it for the money yeah he would have put these songs out Absolutely. during the hype of madagascar yeah 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 or so like when madagascar's finished he's, he's like people are going to want more madagascar let me release music but no he waited he'd, he yeah exactly it's so it, it's thing. like you know he made the money from madagascar <laughs> he- <laughs> no, stay with it stay with it <laughs> he, he made the money from madagascar and he like just like bought his land like he just like you know he settled down whatever but like i did hear that he like he got quite into heroin at a point and like that all comes out in the documentary yeah yeah. and so when he's singing (laughs) 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 summertime sadness i just saw like a very short clip and he's got like the trilby cigarette scarf Mm -hmm. blazer he's like 
massive thin, hangover. Thin, 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 thinnest you've ever seen. Like, you think Pete Doherty looked bad at one point? Like, he makes Pete Doherty look like an Olympian. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. In that documentary, but, like, it's... We love a comeback king. Obviously, we love king, a comeback king. like King Julian in Madagascar. Like, yeah, he he was like in good shape. He was like slim. But they had him on steroids the entire time. Oh fuck! You joking? No. <laughs> <laughs> Are you fucking no, joking? No, no, no. Look it up. But they all are. <laughs> look it up. They all, they're all they are. are. They're they all, all are. are. Um, but yeah, the the documentary looks really harrowing and like. He sings his arse off because of the pain, and I'm I'm excited to see. There's, yeah, there's a difference between a singer, a performer, and an artist. Yeah, and there are some people who have like the most amazing voices on the planet. There are people who can dance, twirl, like flips, kicks, tricks, all of that. And then there are some people where all they need to do is stand there and emote yeah and it hits something i've never felt more human than when i listen to that album yeah 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 there's something about king junior because there are some that i find funny like the toad ones i do find funny um eric cartman shout out to you again amazing singing voice that's someone who's a singer he's a performer king julian there's just there's just something so raw yeah and human about king julian well yeah <laughs> so less T- to note a few though to note a few the this one isn't um funny i mean not that king julian being in this pain is funny you know it's just a it's not funny ha ha it's funny like that we've all just sat around and let this happen. That's the joke. <laughs> We're the fucking joke. We <laughs> we saw we saw a star fall, yeah. and we all just fucking sat and let it happen. Yeah. And now he's back, and he's releasing music, and he's changing things, and now everyone wants to jump back in, including me. I'm guilty of it. I'll hold my hands up. Like absolutely. I I hadn't thought about King Julian once since the Madagascar films came out. That's the realest thing and you've now, said all and, night. Yeah, and now he's coming and he's making me feel again. Thank and I don't deserve that. Thank you for being honest, though. Halloween is the like one time of year where you can be like your true self. True self. Happy Halloween to you. Thanks. Yeah. But I don't know if you've heard the AI of Frank Sinatra doing Happier Than Ever, the Billie Eilish song. No. Picture it for a second. When I'm away from you. Yo. It's fucking gorgeous. Listen to it. Also, this is an AI, but everyone was saying it was AI, but I actually saw the video of the guy making it, mm. which also, top tip, it is on Spotify as well, of the I'm Just Ken Arctic Monkeys cover. And uh, this yeah, had yeah. me in such a fucking grip yeah a vice hole that i was walking to work listening to the i'm just ken arctic monkeys cover that i'm just ken anywhere, anywhere else i'd be, be a ten. ten fucking good what ha- a fucking song honestly have you seen the pete davidson one no pete davidson for snl he did a i'm just pete it came out last week so like, i'm just pete. Oh, i've been away oh yeah I've been on holiday. I've been on holiday. Yeah, I can't say where. I actually can't say where because I'm gatekeeping it because I will be going back. Oh, I'll tell you. No, I'll tell you. Okay. I'm gatekeeping. I don't want to see anyone else there. Oh my God. The best place I've ever been in my entire life. And there was no one there. Really? The, the entire time, it was like between 25 to 30 degrees every single day for 10 days blue sky um and there were some beaches that have been voted like um most beautiful beaches in the world and we went down there at like 1 p.m and there was like three other people there on this entire stretch of beach we got talking to this woman who worked in like the place like where you could get drinks and stuff um and she was like yeah usually by 10 a.m this whole beach is full if you get here at 10 a.m there is nowhere for you to sit and there are cars parked all the way up to the top of the mountains because it was an island i'll give you that i'll give you that it was an island um sure. gatekeeping that we're fucking going oh like, yeah we are going 
So yeah, I'm gatekeeping that. I'm gaslighting. As you know, speaking of gaslighting, you're you're not doing it. Everyone in my life keeps on trying to gaslight me into. They, everyone in my life is gaslighting me, telling me that I don't look like Anya Taylor Joy, and it's the weirdest fucking thing Whoa. because like I have eyes, I have eyes. Yeah. What do you think is your biggest similarity with her? I honestly think it would be easier to list the things that we don't have in common. Oh yeah. At like at at this point, it's like what are the similarities between King Julian and Jesus Christ? Yeah. It's easier to list the differences. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. Because there's maybe like one. Yeah. Jesus isn't real. <laughs> <laughs> and that's funny because King Julian's not real. <laughs> Come again now? No, I'm joking. Don't, don't put that in. Don't put that in. Oh, something. Fun- Wait, no, but if King Julian is not real, then who's playing? Who's in Madagascar? No, I'm joke. It was a joke. Okay. Well, it's because it's, it's, ha- it's, it's Halloween. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair, fair, fair. yeah. <laughs> um, do you have any more spooky wookies? I have a, f- a couple spooky. Wookies. Oh, that's not a slur. <laughs> Every- oh, everything's a slur. Oh. This isn't a slur, but this is something that I've been... He's been making me laugh for like over a month now. Um, the other day, Jodie came around to my house and one of the first things that she said to me was, I want to bring the word gay back, but as a der- in a derogatory sense. Like, I want to start calling things gay. <laughs> no, no, but like, I'm... A, no, don't... No, and I'm with you. <laughs> we have, we have to you. be careful. Just bring back... That's gay. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Come on. yeah but you can only you can only do that if there's gayness within no, you yeah of course of course of course of course At open gayness within you yeah, yeah yeah if you're if you're in the in the closet yeah you can't do that yeah, you can't no. do that so um, that's why it's allowed okay peoples and i i think <laughs> there's there's few things in this life that is funnier than calling something gay. <laughs> like, it's funny. It's fu- it is fucking funny. Well, it's funny because it's stupid. Yeah, it's... Fu- it's it doesn't make joke, any sense. The joke isn't that... Let me just explain the joke real quick. That'll be a really fun time for everyone. <laughs> yeah. um, the joke isn't that something is gay. It's that someone would say that and mean it. It's such a ridiculous oh, thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. That, that is funny. yeah. No, that's what makes yeah. it funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love it. Yeah. I love it. No, for sure. Oh, something funny. On our last podcast, we spoke about um, A Little Life that James Norton was in. Now that's the real horror. And Ellis slagged it off profusely and I you know, didn't really stop him. Um, the you couldn't have. It was I, I, you couldn't have. No one could have. Less than 24 hours go by and I met James Norton. Yeah, you told me about this. I but that was know. the day. That was the day after. Are I my didn't... boobs even? <sighs> do you care? No, but they do. <laughs> but they do. They do. Um, yeah, less than twenty-four hours after I met him, and I was like, "We went to see a little life. <laughs> it was amazing." Well, genuinely, that's not true. I said you were amazing, and I still and he was. I stand by that now. And I stand right next he, to you. He he was fucking amazing. And speaking of this as well last friday do you know what i did last friday served yeah but yeah i went and saw a play called vanya ring a bell mm. yeah but i don't know why why does that ring a bell it's a one-man show andrew scott <gasps> oh right is this the one that cost 100 pounds yeah okay how was change your life fucking amazing i believe that i believe that like he was playing a big group of different people. Mm. It was so realistic to the point that when you when he would act as if someone's walked in the room, I You'd look. I would look. Obviously, no one's going to walk in the fucking room. It's a one man show. It's fucking amazing. He was on stage for two hours. It was the whole thing, no intermission. He Whoa. did not leave the stage once. So fucking good. Vanya tickets were. 100 British stand. So I'm glad it was good. Fuck me. Fucking hell. 
if I'd have paid real money to go see it at life, fuck you know. Because do you know how expensive those tickets are? That's why they've um, filmed it and they're releasing it like next year. And all the girlies going nuts. I need to ask a question. What the fuck is wrong with you people? Why? Oh my God. You know, I'm not going to get into it again because my feelings were very well articulated yeah. last time. Yeah, fair. No, I'm, I, we shouldn't. But I just found it funny re-watching the podcast last mm. week. And then so boom, I, there he is. I met him the next day. Yeah. Um. This is really mean. But I need to say it. TikTok needs to stop showing me those watch this three or like POV, you watched this three times so my cat could like get surgery. Because baby, that cat is gonna fucking die. I'm not watching that. I'm scrolling past. I don't care. TikTok, you need to put that on someone else's algorithm because all of those pets are going to die. I'm not watching it. I don't care. Maybe I will copy link because that takes me half a second. You need to put oh, it on Oh, is that all you need to do? Copy link? Sometimes. Like, that's what they say. They're like, you pressed three buttons and blah, 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 yeah, blah. Yeah, interact. I was like, I'm not messing up my algorithm. I have my algorithm down to a science. Every single thing on my For You page that's for me like oh mine's fucked no mine is like fine-tuned i i'm really sorry about your cat that's not my cat that's not my cat this it's not it's Uh, not last time i checked it's not my cat see i i get sucked into those i'm like okay i'll give you fu- and why if that's the case why did they make the video so long that's what i'm saying if it's like watch this video make it one second say can you watch it for 10 seconds you've got 10 mm. views gorge. although there is something i've heard that apparently in order to like monetize a video it has to be over Certain a minute length. <gasps> it has to be over a minute in order to be monetized so even then i'm like but yeah, I'm just being I'm just being super upfront because Halloween is the one time of year where you can be who you truly are and Absolutely. you can be authentic and you can be yourself and you can put that out to the world. Um 100%. so this is me, Lil Orphan Ice Spice, telling you from my heart <laughs> that if your cat needs an operation don't put it on my for you page. I'm not watching that video. I'm sorry. The cat's I'm not gonna, doing it. Do you mean like the cat's gonna die like regardless, or like the it's cat's just, gonna die because I'm not watching it? Well, the whole thing about them is like, you you watch the video and you interact with it so that it gets boosted on the algorithm yeah, and they yeah, can yeah. like make fun and fund the surgery. Yeah. If it's put on my for you page, TikTok's gonna think that video is a dud because so quick, so quick. <laughs> I'm I'm gone. I need I need my colors, noises, shapes. That's what I'm there for. TikTok is like Coco Melon to me. I'm just I'm just I'm there to disassociate. Yeah. I just want I want noises, colors and shapes. Yeah. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. And you can't save everyone. No. You can't save everyone. You can't. You can't save everyone. And you can't even try. Like, how, what, I'm going to try and save everyone? You want me to spend 15 seconds <laughs> watching your video three times? And you want me to press my screen twice? You want me to click the share and then copy link? At least Baby, make it I'm, funny. I'm one man. <laughs> I'm, I'm one man. I'm I can't a, do it I'm all. I'm a strong man. <laughs> I'm a strong, independent orphan rapstress and that's that's all i can be and you asking me to be a good samaritan that's not who i am Mm -mm. and i i I wish i could be that for you like i wish i could change for you but i can't change for it i can't change the only person i can change for is for me thank you for speaking so is someone playing Gary Come Home? Because I'm, pe- I'm really feeling it right Bring now. in the sick bags. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh my god! Update: I finally broke fifteen hours screen time. Last time it was fourteen hours, mm-hmm. and now I've got it over fifteen. So this day was at home. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Of course. In bed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite place to be. Ellis, how's your mental health? I feel like I'm good. <laughs> like I gen like I'm not joking. I genuinely feel like I'm good. I think I just like to live, and I like to live how I want to live. And sometimes, sometimes I do just want to lie in bed for like fifteen hours and just look at noises, shapes, colors. I I appreciate that. Not every day, but like I I appreciate that for most people that is probably unhealthy. And hey, maybe it's unhealthy for me as well. But it feels good. Yeah. And if it feels good, why stop? Yeah. And that's that's for everything. There's. There's no such thing as too much of a good thing. I think if it fit, that can if be... If it feels good, do it. But that can be used in different ways. Like if you're a drug addict yeah. or an alcoholic. <laughs> do more. If, this is when I want to point out again that this... this that is El- Ellis is joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, something else that this genuinely scares me. Like this actually scares me. People, if you can sleep with earplugs in, natural selection is coming for you. I'm sorry. Like, the wilds to come will get you. If you can fall asleep with the only sense that is keeping you alive while you're unconscious, bound and removed, you you are devolved. Not you, for me. It's you not have for devolved. Me. My, that's my this, sister. When when this whole thing collapses, when society falls in on itself, which is going to happen. Look at me. It's happening right now. <laughs> <laughs> look at me. It's happening. If you can fall asleep with your senses removed, willingly taken away from you. Yeah. You are not prepared for the wilds to come. Nature is coming for you. Yeah, no, that's that's a that's a that's weird wild thing. To me. That's a weird thing for me. Like I'm I'm so ready to survive that I if I'm sleeping at someone else's house, I have to wear an eye mask because any amount of light that gets in, I'm awake. Yeah. I'm awake because I'm I'm ready for the killer. But like, I know the killer's coming. Oh, full circle moment. Full circle moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know the killer's coming. And I'm ready for him. We've just had a thing with our landlords just talking about this, but sounds, sounds random, but where we've lived here for two months and someone came, a contractor came on the second day we lived here to do, to change the oven or something like that. We got an email from our state agents like last week. So it's been two months saying like, mm. hi, like we've realized like we don't actually have the spare key for you here that we have here so like can you please come in um at some point so we can get some keys cut like thank you bye i was stood there when they gave in the estate agents where they gave the key to the contractor we're aware you should have a set of keys i was stood there when the keys were given uh what's happened to these and they were like oh uh we never got them back what and we're like what yeah and we're like wait how long how long between two, this conversation and the keys being given two months two months maybe even longer than two months and they kept saying it is really important that we have a set of your keys if you in case you're locked out or in case there's a gas leak or whatever and we're like no 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 we're aware mm. you don't have to sell that to oh, us yeah we we know it's important that we can get in our house do you know what else is important who else can get in our house yes that's important the killer so my exactly we're like three girls in our 20s here three young sexy, sexy gorgeous mamas. smart mamas we're like i'm sorry you're so cool sexy fly and hot that everyone's gonna want to like eat your brains exactly because that's where like the 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 humanity exists yeah 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 and the heart eating yeah. brains and heart and that's like a halloween kind of thing as mm-hmm. well so that works and so we got into this like huge back and forth like please change the keys 
like this week change the locks like this week like we're not asking for anything else please just change the locks like hello blah 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 we will not be doing this like due to the abrupt tone of your email blah 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 blah. it's like dude fucking sort your fucking shit out what so you're not even kicking up a fuss you're literally like change the locks and then we'll talk yeah Yo, so people then, need to get a fucking clue. So her... Ah! Oh my God, oh my God, no, that... <laughs> you saw everything. You saw what I had for dinner. I didn't. <laughs> I didn't. Um, so my housemate's friend, who is a lawyer... Nice. Put together like an email through our our tenancy agreement. Like mm. just pointed things out. Nothing, nothing, whatever. It's all fucking in there. Mm. And... It was like, change our fucking locks. Like, change our locks. Mm. And then they took, like, two days to reply. So then Thea messaged saying, like, hello, when will be we be expecting a reply from you? And they were like, oh, hi. They No, they were like, oh, we contacted the contractor and he can't find them. So it's like a measure of goodwill. He's going to come and change the locks for you. Not even, not even... We are so fucking sorry. We've we've really messed up here. We're going to change the locks for you. It was actually insane. But like... People need to get a clue. People either need to get a clue or get hit. And I mean that sincerely. Yeah, so we don't like them. If you're watching. You're on my list. Yeah. You're on my list. Because plot twist, I'm the killer. Fucking plot twist, I'm the killer. And I'm coming for you. Yeah like like damn keep it a stack quit playing with them riot <laughs> <laughs> quit playing with them riot uh. Uh. <laughs> that's more meg i know it's i know it's meg the stallion i know that's her <laughs> name meg the stallion that would be a good halloween costume as well if i came as a centaur <laughs> but like top half meg the stallion and then the bottom half no but why is she a centaur has that been done she isn't a centaur no but the stallion oh me. that's I, no but i i was like how does it why does that connect in my brain that's like purple no i mean brown horse seven thursday thursday history as a subject meg the stallion <laughs> centauran is because it's yeah, yeah. The stallion. okay that's that's where we got that from this has been good i've been having a really good time like the last one i was like did we vibe we always vibe no we always vibe i mean were we a, a vibe not, oh, I not see. did we vibe <laughs> yeah did are I, we a vibe like, you know we recorded last week and i got to think i was like i don't know if i like you <laughs> <laughs> i don't know if i fun with this dude <laughs> me like i don't i don't, I don't think, think i, I like, like this you. dude yeah i don't know if he's for me um okay let's do quick and it's always fun i always do like doing this bit let's do consumption junction i have been consuming yellow jackets oh my god yeah, i need to watch I've, this it has been a long time since i've enjoyed a show to this extent season one flawless season two i'm like halfway through it because i'm trying to like make it last love it love it love it love it love it christina ricci is one of my all-time favorite human beings on this planet she fucking makes this show it just every all of them just brilliant 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 apart from i don't like the fact that there's just random girls in the second season oh. who weren't there in the first season oh, and yeah. we're just supposed to just like mm. go along with it other than that fucking vibe yellow jackets oh my god so good cheaper by the dozen Perfect film. Perfect <laughs> film. Perfect film. Perfect fucking film. Perfect film. Oh my God. Perfect film. Perfect cast. Oh my like, God. Like, oh Steve my God. Steve Martin. Steve Martin. I Steve used Martin, to say- Hilary Duff and Superman. Young Superman. Young Superman. Tom Small, Welling. Smallville. Smallville. Ashton yeah. Kutcher. It's not Ashton Kutcher. He's in it though. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought you meant Ashton Kutcher was Superman. No, no. but for the guy from Smallville. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. And- the thing about che- oh sorry <laughs> cheaper by the dozen i used to always say i want to grow up and marry steve martin and have 12 kids because of that film and there's still time uh, steve 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 um like that yeah that's how i'm gonna leave it because i'm not sure if oh <laughs> i forget that that's on my 
Head, look, I made these. Whee. That looks amazing. <laughs> no, genuinely, I've been looking at them. Fucking and they amazing. Look fucking great. Hey, my horns are up here. <laughs> <laughs> my eyes are down here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nice. That's better. That's yeah, better. yeah, yeah. Thanks. Sorry, consumption. Yeah, that's it. My consumption junction, yellow jacket. I do need to Holy watch it. Holy shit. I do need to watch it. Cannot recommend enough. I have not been gripped by a series in so long. And okay. this has me. How many series are there? There's two so far, but I'm very confident. Still in the making. Be a third. Okay, yeah. cool, 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 cool. My consumption junction. I am listening to one album and one album only. I don't know how you feel about her, but you know she's my one of my girls. Olivia Rodrigo's new album. Love her. Haven't I've only listened to the singles. Love the singles. So the album is so good. I believe it's you. the only album I've been listening to. Every day I leave the house from the top and I'm only listening to in it order. in order. Love yeah. That. I That's, don't do any I, of that I do shuffle. The same thing. I do if I'm the same listening thing. to an album, they have crafted the that layout of songs. For a reason, mm, it's like they cook- link. It's a story. It's like cooking a recipe out of order. Yeah, it is literally like, yeah. Yeah, I'm with you. you I'm with you. You have you have to do. It. So Olivia Rodrigo's new album is so fucking good. So fucking good. Have I been consuming any music? Music. Nothing out of the ordinary. Nothing out of the ordinary, boys. <laughs> that's for um, the that's for the OG fans. Am I right, boys? That one's for the OG fans. <laughs> if you know, you know, and if you don't. Get into it. Uh, a video came up the other day of the ordinary bro- ordinary boys and Lady Sovereign Whoa. from like the two thousands performing just, together. You've just unlocked something in my brain that's been left in the dust and the dark for like 10, 15 years. Oh my years. gosh, my, my days, days are, are getting, getting longer, longer and there's no turning no back. back. I'm working. Out. I'm giving Wendy Williams. I've just clocked. I've just clocked. I'm I'm giving Wendy Williams. You're very feminine. Like it's very feminine. Your little leggies in those tights as well. Like, I've 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 said it once. I'll say it again. The Lord made me a male and a man for a reason because I would have been a fucking menace. I would like to properly put you in drag one day because I just know, I know that you are Naomi Smalls. You are. I know. If we, but like fully, fully, I'd have to, someone who is like very, very good at drag, yeah, would have to do it. Yeah, I don't want any rough sh- shit. No, it needs to be polished. Drag can either look uh, mm. or ah. yeah. Don't get me wrong. I think I could be a great campy queen, but I want, I want to look like Naomi Smalls. Yeah, but like who doesn't? Let's be honest. And you would. Mm. Oh, speaking of Drag Race, I don't know if you've watched it. Kate Butch from Drag Race UK season five. You mean everything to me. The woman that you are. That's a good name for a drag queen. Kate Butch, f- brilliant. And yeah. it's she's just as smart as the name. Great cast, amazing cast. Loving this cast. Well, well done, cast of RuPaul yeah, well UK done from us. Season five. You know, from you've us. been waiting for that our, means so much. Our stamp of approval. You got it. That means so much to you. Congratulations. Thank you. You're welcome. From from two women to the from other from women. RuPaul and Michelle <laughs> <laughs> Michelle Visage. But next no, year, Ellis. It doesn't have to be next year. Look at us right now. You are RuPaul. <laughs> oh and I, I am Michelle Visage right now. You know, the thing about Halloween is that it's it's the only time of the, the year you can be your true, real, authentic selves. That's the thing about Halloween. And that's the thing it's always been. And it always will be. You know what? I want to be really real and vulnerable with you right now. Yeah. <laughs> That was actually weird because I've been so used to, so used to that. This is me. Is that a wig? Is that you? <laughs> what did you do? I pull my skin off. Live action Scooby Doo. <laughs> that now that's a nightmare. That's a fucking, that's a nightmare. fucking nightmare. This outfit with Scooby's <laughs> head. That? Fuck, dude. I fucking love live action Scooby Doo. It's a shame he never did any, like, branched into any other, like, <laughs> films or TV shows or anything like that. I think he would have been a great TV presenter. But, but 
I don't what, guess. so he's not been in anything He's else. not. He was only in the Scooby-Doo films, which is so weird because I was like, they were such smash hits and every other member of the cast went out on to do like massive things. She had Sarah Michelle Gellar, Freddie Pinch Jr., um, She Who Will Not Be Named because I don't fuck with the orange one. Um, and was it Matthew Iliard? So every, every, mem- every member of the cast. Yeah, the only ones who didn't go on to do more stuff that I can think of is obviously Scooby Doo and the I don't know the actor's name, but the one who played Scrappy. No, but that's so weird because I've I feel like I've seen Scooby in thing. Like wasn't Scooby Scooby Scoob wasn't Scooby in like um Broad second season of Broadchurch with David Tennant? Oh my god, yes. Yes, no, he is. Oh, okay, really, great. Was... We've I've just wasted like fucking ten minutes, so I'm gonna have to edit out. Great. <laughs> there was like an episode, I think. No, I I I, I think you're right. There was and like I'm, a dinner date with him and Olivia Coleman. I'm pretty sure he was on, um, I don't know what season, because I, I think it was the season I was really busy, so I didn't get a chance to watch it, but one of the Celebrity Big Brothers. He did Big Brother. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <He did>. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, thank you guys so much for tuning into this spooky wookie episode. Ooh, I need to put this back on because I feel do. so weird. Please do. Um, you sign off. But yeah, well. thank you. Um, yeah, well, thank you guys for watching our Halloween special. We hope you've enjoyed it. Being I know I have. Extra silly today. Yeah, extra just silly, silly sausages. This is the only time of year that you can really be who you are. <laughs> and fucking take that. Yeah, take that. Take like, that. The but reason don't, don't play take that because... No. Don't care for take that that much. Yeah. But um, thank you. If you've got this far... Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, nice things. Subscribe, comment, nice things. Share it with your friends. Forward it on. Send it to your mum. Yeah, send it to your loved ones. Um, and yeah, this has been this has been wonderful. So from uh, RuPaul, Andre Charles slash <laughs> Lil Orphan Ice Spice. Happy Halloween. <laughs> and I mean that. And I mean that. So f- yeah, from uh, Michelle Visage and the devil and the devil uh and from rupaul andre charles uh and lil orphan ice spice happy halloween happy halloween and like we really mean that we really mean that from mm. the heart love you uh, like damn keep this there yeah, yeah. stop playing with ryan